ACC basketball returns on a Sunday afternoon in South Bend, Indiana, in a rematch of the 2001 National Championship game. It's the Big Ten versus the ACC. Purdue against 14th ranked Notre Dame. Watson to Wolf and Bransford round out the starting five. Off the bounce and a steal. Stephanie, what can Purdue do to be more efficient offensively? Is there a simple solution? Well, they got to find a way to get out in transition, and there's Hannah Hidalgo continuing to cause problems. If I'm Katie Gerald's, yes, I want to talk about it. And finding where the mismatch is, allowing their team to go to work. Maddie Westfeld, she can play it on the post, she can initiate the break. But that how good is that Marshall been? Here comes Hidalgo. Off the screen, weaving her way through traffic and the bounce. Game to go along with five rebounds and three steals. You know, she's just been able to do exactly what she wants with the ball in her hands. When to take her foot off the gas, so to speak. And she's got a lot of those things that you just can't teach. And she's got the intangibles, understanding the pace. Again, right there, attacking the big rim, finishing in traffic, playing terrific in the two-man game, making the right read. With the Fighting Irish at full strength, Hidalgo having a full season under her belt. I think that would be something to watch. DeWolf from downtown. Seeing the growth, the ability to respond on the road against Tennessee in a game without Sonya Citron. But that young lady right there, Hannah Hidalgo, is one of the reasons why. Hidalgo living up to the hype once again. No doubt about it. She's getting in the paint. She's finishing in traffic. Eight points already in the first quarter. Great balance, great body control. She's got Notre Dame on top. No, I think she's done a really good job of, of getting talented players, in-state in state players, keeping them there, which is something that Purdue had done traditionally. You know, as, as the Wolf knocks down another three. And, right, she's, she's just playing incredible basketball. I mean, she's shooting nearly 50% from the three-point line, looks stronger, looks healthy. Notre Dame's defense persistently outstanding. How about that look? Inside to Marshall. Ben Stephanie, how about this last sequence? Well, this is a terrific catch and gather by DeWolf. Play like a first year player, like a freshman, and it just has a larger sense of self awareness and her importance coming into this program and what she's responsible for. And, and more, there's a difference in, in players who play the game and players. And Purdue has the basketball trailing by 17. Trailed by as many as 20 in our first two quarters. Inside Ellis and stripped by Hidalgo. Another steal. Get retaped. Tighten it up a little bit. Off the fake on the pass. Marshall gets it back up and in. Four, seven of nine. She's made her presence known offensively, defensively. I love how aggressive she's been watching the emergence of, of Nat Marshall in these last four or five ball games and the confidence that she's playing with. You know, it's, it, it brings a smile to my face, so I know it brings a smile to Neil Ivy's face. I mean, she's doing it on both ends of the court in transition. Westbelt has 12. Speaking of that number, a dozen for 21 in white. Another steal. But, but also, I think the growth process for this Purdue team is, is really learning how to get that ball moving a little bit quicker offensively to try to make your life easier. She makes it look that way, doesn't she? The ability to again initiate. For Hidalgo. It's number six. The crossover, the mid range. Easy, too. Notre Dame is rolling, thanks in large part to number three. Only three. Hidalgo tracks down another board. Looking for another dime. Inside, yes! Stars are shining brightly for the Fighting Irish, Stephanie. Head up in transition, finds the Wolf. Purdue back to work on offense. Just see the spacing for Purdue is not there. Hidalgo gets another steal out in transition. And when you have a, a player who's a point guard, who's a terrific defensive rebounder like Hannah Hidalgo. If you do get these players back, how quickly can you get them integrated? Are they practicing over break when you've got some time to really focus on that, or are you having to do it in live game action? Stevenson, no. 
Westbelt clears the rebound. And ahead another time drop. That is number eight. Already with a double-double for Matty Westbelt, 16 and 11. Inside Hidalgo. As this one comes to a close, 76-39 the final. And Hidalgo still dapping everybody up post-game.